Hi, I'm Mary. If you're like me and if you've ever gone to a restaurant, you get handed that menu. What is with that menu? Can I see this real quick? So I will have the, uh... oh, it's on the back? Sure, no problem, hang on. I'm gonna give you a little cheat sheet on how to order white wine. I'm gonna walk you through Chardonnay, Sauvignon Blanc, Pinot Grigio, and Riesling. Beautiful thing about white wine is it's very versatile. It's great for a special occasion, but it's even better for no occasion at all. So let's get started. First up, Chardonnay. This mild and buttery white wine is the perfect go-to for any novice. Originating from Burgundy, this green skin grape is now the most popular in the world. In 1976, an American Chardonnay beat a French Chardonnay in the judgment of Paris. And that started the American explosion of Chardonnay. This wine has a deep golden color and depending on the climate can produce a variety of flavors. In the warmer climates like California, Argentina, Australia, you really taste the fruit of the apple, pineapple, and even a little melon. In the cooler climates like France and Oregon, you'll get a much more acidic profile with some lime and lemon. Like most white wines, Chardonnay pairs well with fish, but because of its sometimes oaky and toasted flavors, this wine is an excellent partner for smoked fish, shellfish, and the luxe texture complements the creaminess of risotto and winter soups. Next up, Sav, uh, Savin, what is it? Savignon Blanc. Savin sa what? If you don't drink Sauvignon Blanc, you need to up your game. This crispy dry white wine is an excellent wine to add to your repertoire. See that? Sauvignon Blanc and repertoire. She can learn things. Sauvignon means wild, which sounds really fancy. Uncle Dave can't come to any more Thanksgivings. He gets two Sauvignon. This white wine has a whole spectrum of flavor profiles, herbaceous, fruity, bold, acidic. It's like a Jackson Pollock if the colors were flavors and if I understood art. The warmer climates give you a passion fruit flavor, whereas the cooler climates will deliver an herbal, minerally punch that pairs perfectly with oysters, veggies, and cheese. Have you ever heard of Fumé Blanc? That's what you say to a French person after they sneeze. Fumé Blanc is Sauvignon Blanc that's been aged in oak barrels to mellow out the acidity and shovel some smoky flavor into the wine. If you're looking for a thrill, order a little Sauvignon. P-no, more like P-yes. Pinot Grigio gets a bad rap, and most people think it's boring, but the right Pinot Grigio can be one of the best choices on the wine list. The Italian-born dry wine gets his flavor from a punch of acidity and hints of lemon, limes, and green apple. Pinot is thought to be a relative of the Pinot Noir family, and unlike other white wines, its grape is a bluish gray. So Pinot Grigio comes in a handful of varieties depending on its climate. If it's warm, it's fruity and dry, like myself. And if the temp is cool, like in Italy, you'll get a dry and minerally flavor. Also, if you say Pinot Gris, that's Pinot Grigio in France. What can't you eat with Pinot Grigio? It's crazy diverse. Seafood, poultry, cheese, salad, veggies. Cheetos. Pinot Grigio is like the single bridesmaid during the last song of the night. She'll dance with just about anybody. And holding on to the back bumper of popular white wines is Riesling. Riesling is a German bred white with an amazing depth of flavor. People's first thought of Riesling is it's too sweet. And that's totally not true. The best way to tell if it's dry or sweet is to take a big sip of it, is to take a look at the alcohol content. The higher the alcohol, the drier. So remember, high and dry, or low and sweeto. You make it up, it'll work. Riesling is the perfect partner for spicy Thai food, Mexican dishes, and really anything packed with bold spices and heat. Especially the lower alcohol, more fruity Riesling. Why? Because the sweet from the Riesling fights the heat in your mouth, and who wins? You do. High alcohol makes the heat hotter and can ruin your meal, but a slightly sweet Riesling can take the meal to the next level. What have we learned? Chardonnay, 
Any Day, Mild and Buttery, Sauvignon Blanc, Wild Child, Pinot Grigio, Forget the Haters, Goes Great with All Your Taters, Riesling, High and Dry, but the low and fruity will soothe the heat. Got it? That's it. I'm Mary, you're you, this is delicious wine, let's have some, and now that I'm an expert, this is white wine. We're done.